Welcome to CEO Money. I'm Michael Yorba. Thanks for joining with us. I have Meyer Barak, Chairman and Head Trader, coming to us from Berlin, Germany. Meyer, welcome to the show. Thank you, Michael. Very happy to be on the show. All right, Meyer, um, why did you decide to become a stock trader? Let's start with that. Well, uh, it goes back uh, quite a few years. Uh, I've been trading for the past 18 years, but uh, uh, if I go back before that, I was uh, for many years in the high-tech industry, alone, involved in a lot of uh, startup. I come from Israel, and I was doing several type of online business. And um, at one point, I decided I want to start working for home. You know how it is in the uh, high-tech industry. You uh, go out of home before the rush hour starts, and then you come back after the rush hour. You meet the family the weekends, I had a small crisis. I took my daughter to the kindergarten and uh, um, she said, uh, well, daddy, that was my kindergarten two years ago and <laughs> you know how it goes. So I decided I want to change my life, work from home. Um, didn't have too many choice back in 2000, uh, what to do from home, make a living and a decent living. Um, I heard about trading. I decided I'm going to try it. Why are you teaching other people your secrets? Isn't it better to keep them to yourself? Um, there's no secrets in the market. Um, I don't do anything special. I do the exact same things being done in the markets for the past few hundred years. I'm not a penny stock trader. I'm not a cryptocurrency trader. I am trading regular stocks over $10, uh, high volume. I'm doing the same things people have been doing for the past hundreds of years. Uh, they, well, they didn't have computers back then, but uh, we trade the same type of stocks, high volume stocks. There's nothing that I invented. I mean, of course, when you start trading, you develop your own systems, but it's all based on ancient history. So anything I'm teaching is just having the discipline, uh, using the right systems, um, doing the right thing, which is not easy, as you well know, okay. and you know, just surviving the market. That's it. There's no secrets in what we do. Absolutely none. Why did you decide to write a book? Well, um, that goes back when I started uh, learning how to trade. Um, I did all the mistakes in the book, of course, you know, and I, I bought a few books and I started reading them. And I won't get into names. I really admire the people who wrote these books. So I, I, I read them and it helped me to become a trader. I also traveled to the US. I'm not from the US, so I, I traveled to the US. I had a mentor in Phoenix, Arizona, and um, he taught me everything I know, plus the books, of course. And I came back home and started trading and it was a long journey. It probably took me two years to get to the point where I stopped losing money and then after I became successful, which probably I could say took three to four years, and I'm not talking about successful making millions of dollars, I never did, but become successful meaning I'm, I was making money regularly and I knew my way in the trading industry, I read the books again. And at that point, I came to the conclusion that the person who wrote the books had no clue about making money successfully in the market. <laughs> Only, I, I mean, you know what I'm talking about. I've been doing this for 30 years. I've been waiting for somebody to say that besides me. <laughs> Go ahead. You see, Michael, you see, Michael, I was reading the books, and it's the small details. I mean, it's just the small details, where to take the profit, where to put the stop loss, how to do this, how to do that. Right. You, you, you have no idea when you're reading that when you're just starting out. But after quite a few years, when you trading and you know all about the market and you become successful, which is not easy in the market. And then you read those books again and you say, oh, he couldn't have written that if he was making money regularly in the market. Impossible. How could he write that? So you see, there's a lot of people who write great books and they are great educators. And I'm not saying to people, don't read these books, don't, don't, don't use them. I'm just saying, when I read them again, I said, well, I got to write a book from the perspective of the trader who, 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 who knows how to make money in the market. And excuse me for saying, I, I, I do know how to do that. So I just felt like I had to write a book. That good. And I wrote one. Good, good answer. All right, how transparent are you when it comes to your personal trading results? 
very, very transparent. My, my, my trading account, well, we have a, a live trading room. A few thousands of people are joining my live trading room every day, and they're watching over my shoulder. They see my charts, they see what I buy, they see what I sell. Every stock I will buy, I will talk about it before. I will explain why. Not always do I have the time, and but I will always post it. I'll write it down, I'll discuss it, I'll trade it, and I'll post my PNL. So I'm posting my PNL live every day. They look behind my shoulder, they see me trade. And you know, when I started out doing that many years ago, that was a very hard thing to do. When people look back at your shoulder, from your shoulder, from your phone back, look at your trading account, that, that, that made me quite nervous. But after a few years, it didn't, that wasn't easy. After a few years, I got used to it and that helps me become very disciplined because I can't see them looking at me and seeing me making the regular type of mistakes as a trader. I just have to be better. And the way to become better is to have thousands of people watching you, talking to you, hearing you, mirroring my trades as much as they like to. And if I make a mistake, if I'm not disciplined enough, if I'm over trading, if I'm doing, if I'm, I don't know, doubling down on a losing trade or whatever, which I would never do because so many people are watching me, then it makes me a better trader. I found out the way to become a better trader if people are watching you. Got it. Now, how hard, uh, just tell our, our audience, how hard is it to become a trader? probably one of the hardest uh, missions out there in the world. You know, I think I have the world's best profession. Um, becoming a trader was my dream and I achieved it. And I'm teaching so many people to become traders too. And well, I can tell you based on my experience, 90% of my students will fail. It's not an easy profession. It is a very, very hard profession. And in order to succeed, you, you, you must have a lot of discipline, a lot of um, willpower to become a trader. You must want it with, <laughs> with, with I mean, it has to be your, 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 you have to think about it, dream about it and go all the way. And it's, it's a marathon, it's not a sprint. And people just don't realize that. I would tell them, I will tell them, I will tell all my students how hard it is, how, how, what is the likelihood of them becoming traders. And they will say, well, okay, I mean, some of them, not all of them, but I would be, I mean, I would probably go around and talk to them like 10 minutes, how hard did become a trader? And then somebody would ask me after 10 minutes, well, okay, but how much money will I be making after six months? <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Uh, people don't really realize how hard it is. It is a very, very hard profession. But, you know, having a business is hard. Uh, four out of five businesses will fail. Is it good enough not to open the fifth in order to succeed? Uh, nine out of 10 traders will fail. The one who succeeds have the world's best profession. Um, I live in Berlin right now. I just decided I want to live a year or so in different places all around the world, I can do that. I just change my address, I buy a new computer wherever I, wherever I get to, and I just do whatever I like to do. I mean, is there anything better than that? Oh, not at all. I mean, I know a couple of guys that the, they just have houses around the world and they just go from house to house. They set up their, their trading platforms in each house and they move around and they trade. Um, talk to me about TradeNet and how it helps traders what it, what precisely is it doing how does it help them and I'd also like to get into price what, what how much does it cost to participate uh, well trade that is, um, is 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 a, a, a trading college we treat people how to trade mm -hmm. uh, we uh, teach them from the grounds up uh, they don't have to come to us with any experience any knowledge and for those who come with experience and knowledge, we have advanced courses, which of course we can help them to become better traders. Um, so we we mainly teach uh, online, not only. For example, here in Berlin, we have offices. We have uh, offices in London. We have offices in uh, Tel Aviv, and we teach people all around the world. S most of the people who who, who learn with TradeNet uh, are being taught online. Uh, so we have several type of courses. And the main advantage, I would say, is our live trading room. Our live trading room is 
free. It's an online free service. They can join at YouTube. Uh, it's uh, uh, it's a free service where everybody joins. There's thousands of people who are joining us every day at YouTube. And they can, as I mentioned earlier, look behind my shoulder, see my PNL, trade live with me. And... Uh, get some kind of, uh, of a live help, which is, I believe, our main advantage. We, we employ people, me included, who are successful traders. Uh, they can follow us, they can mirror our trades, and they can learn by doing so. I don't believe in mirroring trades for the long run. I believe in starting out with getting some kind of, uh, of help at the beginning because every new beginning is very, very hard. So if people are starting out with us and getting the basics of trading and mirroring our trades to start with, they can get to the point where they start developing their own systems. So we teach them. Uh, we let them trade live with us, which is, I believe, very, very important. And we also have great relationship with some investment firms. So uh, included in our programs is a referral, which we refer them to some investment firms who would give them a live account to trade with. So our basic program, which is a $500 program, uh, discounted in the next few days, but I don't know if the video is going, video is going to go up for $399. Mm -hmm. But our basic program, which costs $500, comes with all the basic education, live trading room access, uh, the one which is a little bit more sophisticated than the free YouTube service, and also a $14,000 funded account. So all of our traders are eligible to receive a $14,000. We don't promise them that they will, but the vast majority of them will get it. Uh, and of course, if they don't like, or if they don't receive the account, they have a 14 day money back guarantee, they can just decide they don't like us. That hardly ever happens. I see it and it goes all the way up to pro. We can talk about the, uh, um, yeah. the points of interest in future, uh, future uh, interviews and I'd like to be able to do that with you. But uh, for now, um, be, this is all the time we have, but Meyer, thank you for being a guest on the show. I really appreciate that. It was my pleasure. Thank you very much for having me. My, well, you're, my, mine too. All right, you've been watching CEO Money with Michael Yorba. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.